Skyblock, one of the most popular game modes in Hypixel. There are thousands of people grind every day, but there are people who took the grind to another level. I am one of them and I found over 4 billion potatoes. It took thousands of hours already and I'm not even close to being done yet, as my ultimate goal has not been reached yet. How did I do it is the question many of you probably ask right now. Just farm, lol. But what do you need to farm efficiently? Many Skyblock players don't know about things that make farming more effortless and more efficient, but let's start with the basics. The farm I mainly use is semi-afk designed by me and my friend. Shout out to him for making this farm possible to even exist. I'm gonna skip talking about the how because everyone should already know how we this work. Moving to my minion setup, of course I have complete maxed. Is it even a question? 31 tier 12 potato minions with military infusions, fly catchers and they constantly get powered by hyper catalysts. And they are expensive, so I'm constantly broke, but great goals require great sacrifices. I also have my minions boosted by farm crystal, tier 5 beacon powered with scorch power crystal, and I forced my friend to FK on my island 24 7 so I can boost my minions with rabbit and potato talisman most of the day, even when I'm manual farming. And manual farming is the main income of potatoes. What you need to manually farm potatoes is strength. Wait, what do you need strength in farming? It's Skyblock, of course you need strength to farm. Many players still use elephant, but it's garbage nowadays. All top farmers who are going for collections use mushroom cow, which give you more farming fortune, plus you get extra money from mushrooms. And that slightly helped me with money for catalysts, but it's still bad. All you need is minus relic and at least 640 strength to make elephant the most useless pet in the game. At this point it becomes better cause you equal on fortune and get mushrooms. Mushroom cow pet is the other reason why I'm constantly broke because I have to spend every single coin I have for strength. Thank you Hypixel, very cool. The last thing I will talk about in this video is stack overflow which is a thing that only affects collections and doesn't affect drops you get. When you replant crops using replenish, crops used to replant is taken from sack and doesn't count toward collection. There are two ways to prevent this from happening, first is having empty sacks but one sack fills in less than a minute so it's completely not efficient. And this is where sack overflow comes. You can fill multiple sacks and then put them in a chest leaving just one in your inventory. What that makes is making the game think you have more resources than you're supposed to have in one sack or something like that so it's not gonna put any more resources in that sack and you're not gonna lose collections. I want to talk about other farming tactics in this video and made something in the future but considering how long it took me to make this video I won't expect it anytime soon. Anyways, join my discord server, link in the description. I will be doing potato farming streams and they are gonna be announced there. That's it for now, see you next time.